Hey y'all, it's me and sis, Sierra Michelle, and I'm back with another video. So as you can tell by the title of today's video, today we are just doing some errands. We going out tonight. I need to find something to wear. I got a couple of other little things I got to do. Um, I look a mess, but that's going to change shortly. Um, we at the gas station. We at Royal Farms. I'm about to take all these Starbucks cups and throw them in the trash. And I'm going to get a little gas. I'm going to be right back. Alright y'all, so the first stop, we are going to go to Five Below. So this broke off. Every couple months, it does break. So I always go in there, I tell them that it breaks. They tell me to grab another one and leave out. So let's see how this is going to go. I did order another one off of Amazon that should be here tomorrow because I'm actually tired of going through this with this. But um, I need something so I can vlog today. So let's go in here and see. All right, y'all, so I'm over here in District Heights at Oil Plug in my oil change. I love coming here because I do not have to get out the car, and y'all already know your girl is lazy, and it comes with a free vacuum, and I don't want the vacuum because I don't want to get out of the car. So, me and little baby is chilling. He is back there sleeping, and I'm ready to shoot across the bridge to do the other stuff that I have to do today. We are going to go to Springfield Mall. I really want a Red Bull. I might just stop at the liquor store. Do this liquor store across the street have a drive through If they do, I'm going to go over there and get a Red Bull because I don't want to get out of the car. All right. We'll be back. All right. The oil is changed. Glad I finally got that out the way. Now we are going to Virginia to go to Forever 21 because even know why i'm going it's just a nice day out and i wanted me and my son to get out the house so i do need to find something to put on to wear tonight i really don't know what i'm gonna do i, I know i'm gonna put my red press on nails on um just a short red set but as far as the outfit goes i think i'm gonna wear these denim boots and this denim purse that i just got and i want to get like a romper hoodie sort of situation of some sort i'm gonna show y'all when i get to forever 21 if they still have a little situation like that um nothing special just something to have a cute picture in and yeah that's pretty much it so did i eat breakfast yeah i ate a hot pocket this morning i ate a ham and cheese hot pocket no starbucks this morning um yeah, I'm super upset that I do not have my phone holder because I really hate holding this phone and vlogging. It's so annoying. But yeah, that's all we're doing. My best friend is doing a hosting tonight. So we are going to pull up over there for a little bit. She doesn't have to be there until 12 ish like 11 45 so we definitely need to get ready early factor in picture time i want to hopefully do a get ready with me maybe a tiktok or something i don't know but we will see how everything plays out i'm not really hungry i don't know y'all i'm just in a season of just like i don't know is anybody else having a hard time like i'm just having a real hard time um y'all know my mom she passed away a couple of months ago y'all know i am three months postpartum my baby will be three months officially tomorrow um my mom passed away a month before it was time for me to give birth to my son so it's just been a lot going on life has changed for me very drastically and i'm just trying to just get through trying to get through um and i've been on maternity leave for a very long time i really don't want to go back to work i'm really trying to figure out what else it is that i want to do what else it is that i can do i'm really a little over the whole service providing situation i was going to go back and do nails you know outside of the press on nails but I really don't want to do that because I really don't want to take clients. I've been doing the eyebrows and the eyebrows are cool. <clears throat> and the eyebrows are cool, but I just know that it's just not meant for me to be doing those things. Like I'm looking for my niche. I'm looking for what it's meant for me to be doing. I'm trying with this content creator sort of situation. And don't get me wrong. Like I love content creating. I do. Um, 
I struggle only because not trying to be consistent, but trying to push out good content. Like it's easy to push out content, but it's a little harder to push out good content. Stuff that people actually want to watch. You know what I'm saying? I don't like just getting on the camera and not talking about nothing. Like it's easy when I have days like today. It's like, okay, I'm doing stuff. I'm moving around. One thing I will say is my girl Glamazon say, yes, I love her. Um, we actually have the same birthday, by the way. But um, I was watching some of her videos the other day. And one thing that I did see was everything doesn't have to be a complete video. Like a lot of her videos kind of ran into each other for days at a time. She was, um, she was doing a lot of the stuff that I do. Go to Home Goods, go to Michaels, like, you know, going out, but it doesn't have to be a full video of that. So once I saw that, I was like, okay, maybe this isn't so. And this is why I need to get my phone stand. But yeah, so once I saw that, I was like, okay, so I do have a lot of wasted footage because I don't, um, a police came. I do have a lot of wasted footage because I always feel like it has to be one complete video. Like I feel like if I get to the end of my day and I didn't complete the video, I just feel like the footage was wasted. So a lot of stuff I just don't get around to posting because I always feel like it's an incomplete video. So now that I'm going to start running my videos into one another, I feel like I am going to pick up and do a lot better um, in this area of things. So that's that. Um, yeah, but I'm not going to talk y'all to death. I'm not going to bore y'all to death. Y'all know I'm always open for... Um, y'all know I'm always open for content ideas um somebody did tell me that they love my little decor videos and things like that i do have a diy project that i am about to post sometime today probably because i did do some little canvas artwork that i'm super excited about i love i just hung it up yesterday and i made it myself what's better than that so yeah um yeah let's just head on out to the mall <laughs> y'all it is such a nice day out here today we are on our way in here let's see what we find oh yeah so i look terrible i am having the hardest time finding an outfit so i'm getting these crew socks for no reason at all i did need me some new silver earrings so i'm gonna get those I did like this little cute silver bag because the boots that I'm wearing tonight, I'm actually going to get them in silver. So I need the cute silver bag because I did not have one. I had, I do have one, but it's just not like those cute fashion forward sort of like looks that I'm going for. Anyway, so I was going to get these blue biker shorts with this blue little cool next little sort of hoodie situation. Uh-huh. And I think I'm going to try to make an outfit out of that because the outfit is denim. So instead of doing a denim bag, I think I'm going to do the silver bag with the all blue because the boots are light blue. So we're just going to see, but let's take this stuff and get out of here because my son is having a fit. Y'all, I had to take Mr. Fussy out the car seat. Now we are leaving the mall because he runs my life. And he is ready to go. So we're going to change his paper and go to the next place. Hi, right, y'all. So I did get me a thumb stand. I'm so super excited about that. Unfortunately, Five Below is no longer doing what I used to tell y'all to do. If this stand here breaks, you will always be able to take it back. You don't need no receipt, no none of that. They literally would just let me walk out the store with another one. So as of July, I guess they recently changed their policy. You have to have the receipt. Like I said, I did order me another kind off of Amazon. So I just got this one in the meantime because I really do want to be able to vlog today and you know, for the rest of my day. So that's that. Um, stink Stink had a Stink Stink. So that's why he was fussing. We are now at Marshall's. Let me find my handicap sticker. We are at Marshall's. We can right go in here and try to get this pumpkin little set that I saw at another Marshall's, but the line was so long, so I did not get it. But he's getting fussy. I have to use the restroom. So let's go in here. And my hair is just looking crazy and crazy. I'm actually going to try and fix it while I'm standing or sitting here. All right, let's 
fix this then let's go all right that looks a lot better so let's take this air paw out my ear because i feel like i'm yelling when i have it but we have a lot more stops to make we still have to go to the beauty supply store and get some color corrector on top of some black dye i still need to fix my wig and everything else to go out tonight so let me grab his bag grab him and this is our last stop here in virginia then we're going to stop the beauty supply store across the bridge and i forgot i don't have to color correct that wig because i forgot i'm wearing bangs because i don't have lashes that just changed the whole dynamics of my whole outfit y'all i'll be right back so it's the glare Alright, so I hate that I always say alright. So I'm getting really annoyed because I'm calling Taste Buds in Capitol Heights to place the order. I wanted some cassava leaves with white rice and she had me on hold for 10 minutes. They always take forever to make your food. The food is pre-made. There's no reason why it's taking this long. It's absolutely crazy. So I've been calling from my other phone numerous times to see if they're going to answer. She hasn't. So yeah that's what we're doing now i know that's about to frustrate me but i want something i can eat on now and later so that's why i'm getting it but i'm tired i'm ready to go in the house i'm ready to get my hair together that i'm gonna wear tonight and i'm ready to take a nap yeah all right y'all so surprisingly they did not take as long making my food today this is the cassava leaves so you get two sides so i did get double rice but it looks really really good it smells really good and y'all it tastes really good as well i'm actually going to eat some right now because i am really hungry it's 223 224 now and i have not ate nothing all day so i'm hungry and i know it's hot mm-hmm mm-hmm Y'all, it's good. Mm-hmm. 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 When I get home, I'm out of rush. Mm-hmm. All right, y'all. So, let me show y'all what I got from the mall. So, I really did not get nothing special. But I got... These shorts that are a size medium, no goodness well, I need a bigger size, but they did not have a large, so we got medium. So you can tell it's like these blue, sort of resembling denim. I have this, and then I also got this little crew neck sort of situation, and it scrunches at the bottom. So I think we're going to go for an all blue sort of look. Y'all, my hair looks so crazy. It's blowing me. Um... But yeah, so we have that. We're either going to wear this and we're going to pair it with our denim boots here. Real cute, real cute. Y'all see where I'm going with this? Okay, the denim boot. And this silver bag here. I just got this from Forever 21 as well, as well as some silver accessories. Or, <clears throat> let's put this to the side. Or we're going to do these blue shorts with this white and red top here with the same boots but then we also have this denim bag that i just picked up from Aldo. so let me know down in the comment section below what y'all think y'all will wear if y'all will wear which one y'all think look better i'm gonna go more so for the hoodie sort of situation i think only because it's gonna be a little chilly and you know i could just kind of roll the sleeves up a little bit but I think when I get in the club, it's going to be giving this white top. So, we're going to see. Let's get started with the wig, and I'll be back. All right, y'all. So, here is the wig that I was referencing. You can see it got, like, a little bang in it. It's kind of long. We are about to <clears throat> style this wig and see what we can make of it. Um, It would be nice if I washed it, but it's not completely awful. So, I'm not going to even put myself through that. Especially since I'm going to get my hair done next week. So, well, this week coming. So, we just going to make it work. Oh, yeah. 
All right, y'all, here's my outfit. I'm mad that this is kind of picking up a different color, but this is my outfit here. We're gonna do these glasses. We're gonna do these earrings. This hat for a pop of color. They go to boots. And then I think I'm going to put on one of my pressed on nails. I don't know which one I'm gonna put on, but I think I'm gonna go for the red. So yeah, that's that. Let me get dressed. I'm so mad. This is not looking like what it's looking like, but you know, it's not the color it looks like, y'all. All right, I'll be back. 